DRS Professional Treasure Detectors are controlled by last generation tablet PCs. They display accurate target analysis with a never seen before image quality. See the shape, metal and depth of your find before you even start digging and stop wasting time on junk targets. Hello, my name is David. I've been the distributor for DRS in France for a couple of years. I've also successfully used some of their equipment during our treasure hunts. That's why the company picked me to introduce you to the new exciting Grand Expert Pro and Grand Expert Lite. Grand Expert Pro and Grand Expert Lite are what we call professional metal detectors. They are not designed to find isolated coins or jewels like other hobby detectors. They are professional detectors. They use pulse induction technology with what we call a big coil or a one meter by one meter frame. Therefore, you can achieve depth from ranging from two meter to five meter on really large targets such as boxes, hordes or uh, weapons. But keep in mind that Grand Expert is not a GPR or a magnetometer. G um, it's a real metal detector. It means you can only find metal, okay? Every kind of metal. What's different with this uh, machine is that it has true discrimination. When you use a professional metal detector with a big coil, you cannot get discrimination, meaning you will find iron, aluminium, and other metals such as silver and gold, of course, but you cannot make a difference. You don't know what you will find before you dig. With the new Grand Expert Pro, you have true metal discrimination. You can make the difference between gold and highly valuable and high run and you can even teach the machine about uh, new metal and this is the first time in the world that a professional metal detector has true discrimination. Now I will show you how the machine works on the field. We will show you also uh, all the settings available and how to assemble it. Grand Expert comes with all accessories and features you need for a successful treasure hunt. The control box allows you to go metal detecting with USB cable that we provide, or if you prefer, you don't need cable. You just turn on the Bluetooth feature of the control box with the tablet PC. The battery is a last generation lithium battery. It can allow you to go metal detecting between six and eight hours. All cables and screws and chargers are provided. We also provide a headphone to remain discreet. We also include a harness so that you don't need to carry everything. You can mount the tablet on the shaft or you can use the special carry box we have. You carry it like this. What's important is the coils. The 45 centimeter coils allows you um, to go deep up to 45, uh, uh, to go deep up to two meters. The little coil is meant for tunnels and uh, in cavities and areas where it's really hard to go. It's a feature really appreciated by treasure hunters. But most of the time you will use what we call our big coil. It's a one by one meter frame that allows you to go between two meters and five meter depth. The tablet PC is also multilingual. Uh, you can choose the, ling the language you want and uh, it includes our homemade uh, 2D software that allows you to uh, successfully use your Grand Expert and it's a software we have designed ourselves. Now we will show you how to use this software. The Grand Expert is very easy to use. First, you plug the battery to the bottom of the control box. Done. Then you choose the coil you want to use. For the demo purpose, we will use a small coil because we're inside and with all the electromagnetic interference, we need to use a small coil. So you plug it to the control box. Also, this thing allows you to do the scan and you plug it here. Then you turn on the tablet. Then you have two icons. The first one is Grand Expert Bluetooth. And the other one is Grand Expert Regular. You use Grand Expert Regular, the green icon, when you use a USB cable. But here for the demo, we will use a Grand Expert Bluetooth. So you just push the blue button. Uh, also, we will use several targets to show you. We have highly valuable target, which is like a big piece of copper. 
We will also use lower conductivity copper, which is going to be uh, described as uh, lower valuable. Also, we will use a piece of junk of iron. We will also show you lead and gold. Unfortunately, we don't have any gold in gold, so we will use a pink gold. It's mixed uh, gold and copper, and we will use pure gold. Now, I will show you how it works on the tablet. When you start the ground expert, you always turn on the control box first, and then you mm, turn on the software. But here, just for demo purpose, we will do the contrary. You'll see it also works. Okay, so let's click on Bluetooth. Okay, the software loads. But you see, we have a problem. It will not detect. You see, please wait. There's no Bluetooth. So to activate Bluetooth, of course, you turn on the control box and then you click here. Then it will synchronize. Connected to Ground Expert. And then it will tell you which coil is connected. Small coil is connected. So let me show you all the features. Remember, we are inside. So you should never use a metal detector inside, but for the demo purpose, we have to. So there's a lot of electromagnetic interference, what we call EMI. So first, magnetic noise elimination, we, el we try to eliminate, you see? Okay. Then sensitivity. The more you put sensitivity, the deeper it goes. But here, we need it to be stable for the demo. So we only put 20% discrimination, even 15. Because under the table, we have iron. So we may have a problem. So general search is like, it shows you what you're going to detect, which metal you want to select or not. Ground balance is basically what you have to do first. So to ground balance is usually something complicated with other metal detectors. This one, Ground Expert does it automatically and it's very easy. What you need to do, you put your coil three centimeters above the ground. Same thing for the 45 centimeter coil. If you're going to use a one by one meter frame, you have to put it 10 centimeters above the ground. Then what you do, you just press ground balance. The value will go usually between 120, 140. If you have a value that goes below 100, it means you have a cable problem. The coil has a problem. And if it goes above 200, it means you're trying to ground balance your detector on a metallic target, which should never be done. It's like a hobby detector. You have to ground balance your detector on a clean area without metal. Okay? So ground balance is made automatically in five seconds. So once again, if it's feature, no other detector has it. Okay, so let's go back to ground balance, see 144, it's okay. At any time you can go back to factory settings. And uh, that's it for this menu. Imaging allows you to see the shape and the metal more precisely that you're going to detect. We will show this after. And the settings, basically you can turn off the system, you can clear the memory of the scan you've made, you can select the language. Here, you know, we have English, so it's okay and help anytime you can have a tutorial. And also, there's a new feature for this new Grand Expert Pro, it is manual discrimination. To start the test, we don't put it on. I will show you what it is for just after. Here, it tells you which version you have, the autonomy that remains in the tablet PC, also in the control box. Remember that when you have low battery, the discrimination is not very effective. To have very good discrimination, you always need full battery level. And uh, that's it. Ground Expert is a metal detector, meaning you can find all kinds of metal. It's not like other um, DRS products such as resistivity meter or magnetometer or GPR. It just focuses on metal. So you cannot find cavities or other anomalies, just metal. So. Look, one kind of metal, copper, gold is metal too, lead is metal, and iron, okay? That's what other, what other professional metal detectors do, you know, you have a big frame and it just tells you that you have metal, but you cannot make the difference, so you waste a lot of time digging on junk, okay? But with Grand Expert, it's really different, look. Let's see, we want to find all metals. We want gold, we want highly conductive, non-ferrous. 
and we want l basically non-ferrous but with lower conductivity but we don't want iron so I don't select iron so look high conductivity you see highly valuable the same with lower conductivity and gold pink gold pure gold whatever gold you use it will always say gold it's very interesting feature lead it's all metal type too. but look iron it's all metal but it's not gold it's not highly valuable it's not valuable because it's iron look if you go here iron so you have true discrimination look it means you want all the metal but just iron look and then all metal but it's not iron but look iron so you have really a true discrimination but it's not all we will show you something else imagine you just want to focus on iron so you find iron but imagine you just want to focus on gold which is a little stupid but look gold Pink gold, no problem too, look, gold. But imagine you don't want copper, look, no copper. And look at this, you get rid of this, completely, it's a big object, you know, it's high conductivity. Okay, you get rid of it, but still, you have the little piece of gold. And remember, we use very, very small sensitivity level because we have a high degree of electromagnetic interference. That's why we have to be closed, you know. Okay, that's very interesting, but no, sometimes we have problems. This is lead. Oh, wait, wait. It says gold, you see? One, sometimes it says gold. It's, it's really a problem because uh, you think it's gold and it's the same with aluminium. You think you're going to find something very interesting, but it ends up being like junk, like lead or whatever. So here comes a new feature. Look, you go on settings and you just go to level number three. Okay, it's like manual discrimination, like a, on a hobby detector. And then you come back here. So look, you just want gold, imagine. And now, every time you pass, Lead doesn't beep, but gold, yes. So imagine, let's put up lead, no sound on lead. It's gonna be the same on aluminium, but gold, pink gold, no problem. And pure gold, look. No other detector in the world, even hobby metal detector, is able to do this. Grand Expert is the only one that can do this. It's just incredible. I am now going to introduce you to another exciting feature of the new Grand Expert Pro. It is the imaging function. To show you this, we will use small gold first. Imaging function allows you to see the shape and the length of the target, as well as its metal, before you even start digging. So, gold. Detector understands you have gold, but now you want to see the shape of the object you find. Go to imaging. You push create new image. And then, to simulate the swipe, you will push four times, it's a double swipe, on the button of the shaft. If you want, you can also use the button on the control box if you're using the big coil. If you don't have the shaft, you use this button. So now I'm going to show you. So we click on create a new image. One, two, three, four. Oops, four. Okay, shape is perfect. You see, it's round. Now I will show you how to save it. Save, you want to save the image, yes. It's gold ring. 
And then you can see all the previous image, you know. Look here. Okay, we only have gold ring right now, but let's try with iron. Create new image, but for iron, we need to select iron, look. Okay, let's go to imaging now. Create new image. Let's try with iron. One. Two. Three. Four. You see, it's a longer object. See, it's a shape, it's perfect. And then, we save the image. We call it iron. And then, let's take a look. You see, this one. And this one, you have the gold ring and the iron. This is just incredible. And you see it's red because it's, an, it's iron. So it's red and gold is yellow. This is the color we chose. But if you want high conductivity and lower conductivity, it's gonna be green and uh, uh, purple. That's why, once again, Grand Expert is a very exciting machine. DRS offers the most advanced metal detectors. They've been designed by our engineers in Germany after years of research and development.